Jen Stoltenberg has called on Tokyo to remain firm in the face of security threats posed by China, North Korea, and Russia's war in Ukraine. Stoltenberg met Japanese Prime Minister Fumio Kishida in Tokyo today. Stoltenberg and Kishida expressed concern about increasing cooperation between China and Russia. Stoltenberg warned that Beijing was keeping a close eye on developments in Ukraine and learning lessons that may influence its future decisions. The two leaders also raised concern about Russia's nuclear threats, a joint military drill between Russia and China near Japan and North Korea's development of nuclear weapons. The war in Ukraine also demonstrates um, that our security is uh, closely closely interconnected. Uh, if uh, President Putin wins uh, in Ukraine, uh, it will be a tragedy for the Ukrainians, but it will also send a very dangerous message uh, through to authoritarian leaders uh, all over the world. Because then the message will be uh, that uh, when they use uh, military force, they can achieve their goals. NATO consists of 30 countries in Europe and North America, and earlier its chief had said that its members are affected by global threats. Last year, Kishida and South Korean President Yoon Suk-yeol became the first leaders from their countries to attend a NATO summit as observers. China has previously criticized NATO's efforts to expand its alliances in Asia and Russia, and Russia has repeatedly cast NATO's expansion as a threat to its security. In December, Japan unveiled plans to boost up its defense capabilities. This will make it the third biggest military spender after the United States and China.